Okay, you better be going safe and sound. Hold tight, Harry! Stupefy! 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 Looney runs in the jeans. Who is that? Luna's father, Xenophilius. We should say hello. He supported Harry all through the summer when the Prophet's been ignoring the truth. Besides, it might be the last chance we get to speak to Luna. It's strange, thinking everyone will be back at Hogwarts without us. I hope this cake... I haven't had wedding cake in forever. I know. Hello, Mr. Lovegood. Ah, I trust you know, Mr. Potter, that we at the Quibbler fully supported Dumbledore during his lifetime, and in his death, support you just as fully. Uh, thanks. Is Luna with you? She lingered in that charming little garden. Such a glorious infestation of gnomes. Or, to give them their correct name, the Gernumbly Gardensi. You might want to congratulate Mr. Weasley on them. He was looking for you just now. Thanks. Yeah, I will. Mr. Weasley must be up there. Where do we even start to look for the Horcruxes? We don't even know what they look like. Well, Dumbledore managed to find two. He destroyed the ring and found the locket. Yeah, but that was a fake, wasn't it? But it looked like the real one. Somewhere there's the real locket. The real Horcrux. A friend of mine went to Beau Baton with her. <laughs> really? Mr. Weasley, did you want to speak to us? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, I did. You see, it turns out that Dumbledore left you things in his will. Huh. All of us? Yes. To you, Ron, mm -hmm. he left his Deluminator. Mm. To Hermione, his copy of the Tales of Beedle the Bard. <laughs> and to you, Harry, he left the snitch you caught in your first Quidditch match. He also left you the sword of Godric Gryffindor. But the Ministry is insisting the sword wasn't Dumbledore's to give away. Not that it matters, because no one can find the sword anyway. Did he say what these were for? I'm afraid he didn't. Now, why don't you pop those up to your rooms and come down to the party? We have a wedding to celebrate, don't we? My mum used to read me the tales of Beedle the Bard. 
How are children's stories supposed to help us find the Horcruxes? Dunno. Maybe Dumbledore just wanted to cheer us up. Do you think all these things are a clue? Are uh, there supposed to be fireworks before the wedding? The Ministry has sworn! The Minister of Magic is dead! <sighs> they are coming! Where are we? We're in London. Shaftesbury Avenue. We need to change. Here, I packed some things in case of emergency. You reckon any of the people here could be Death Eaters? How would the Death Eaters know we were here? They've known where we were every other time. The Muggle News is full of natural disasters. We know what that really means, though. Death Eaters. I brought your visibility cloak, Harry. I thought it would be useful. You think everyone's alright? The wedding? Most of the Order was there. They'll look 